The latest Kenya Bankers Association House Price Index shows that house prices depicted a recovery after seven quarters of contraction. KBSA is depressed credit to the construction and real estate sector and undersupply of new units has triggered the rise with most sales in the period, being on the already completed units from the previous periods. KBA Chief Executive Officer Habilo Laka indicated that house prices in the fourth quarter of 2020 were largely driven by regional differences, an indication that location is now playing a pivotal role. Elsewhere, Kenya's tourism sector has received a boost with an arrival of a chartered flight from Romania. The flight, operated by Tarom Air, landed at the Mo International Airport in Mombasa with 116 passengers on board. Kenya Tourism Board CEO Betty Radier said the flight was a sign of Eastern Europe being a key source market for Kenya's tourism industry as the world continues to grapple with the COVID-19 pandemic. The flight and tour for the 116 visitors was organized by local tour firm Private Safaris East Africa. Finally, rice farmers in Kirinyaga County are set to benefit from agriculture machinery support from a Japanese logistics company. The machines, which include tractors and combine harvesters, will be available for sale to farmers in the Moya Irrigation Scheme. That's the first phase we've started off in Kenya, and if it goes well, and we'll, uh, uh, the idea is to expand to the other areas, other part of uh, East Africa. and uh, Kenya is developing so rapidly, and also there are many, many people uh, working in uh, agriculture um, division. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV.